Hello, this is Spidey1958, and welcome to my Let's Play Spidey's Mod Pack, episode 20, or 45, I believe. It's been quite a while since I did an episode. Part of it is real life with overtime and still having problems with being sick occasionally. But I've also been overcommitted. I'm testing three different mod packs on servers and testing two actual mods and that and I've just had too much. Those who watch my uh, infrequent uh, Twitch will have seen some of this so I apologize. I will try to get back to the priority of getting these done. Uh, the latest version of the mod pack has been set up to be released. Um, it is the version I'm running now. There's been several mods added uh, Balkan's weapons were added, Mr. Crayfish's furniture was added, um, power converters was added back in, and I think there was one more in there. But uh, So that is should be out on the Feed the Beast launcher soon. It's been sent to them, so they just have to go through the approval process. Um, this episode... Remember I built the tree farm. Well, what I was intending to do with the tree farm really didn't work. Because it uh, turns out I couldn't use coal oil for what I wanted to use it for. And I also couldn't automate. Mine chem doesn't automate the way it says it does. So um, what I'm going to do instead is I think I'm going to build steam power and using power converters. But to do that I need steel. Now I could produce steel right now over here in my induction smelter or at least the equivalent of steel which would be refined iron but I think we're actually gonna build the another way to do coal I've been doing a lot of one of the mod packs I'm testing is a heavy grape Greg tech so I've been learning way too much about the newer version of Greg tech and it's definitely takes a lot of work to get anything done so but what we're going to do here is we're going to go ahead and let's get and build a blast furnace for doing our steel. So the first thing I'm going to need is nether brick. And I'm going to need 36 nether bricks. So let's go ahead. I think 36 is right. Oops, I needed to do that over here, didn't I? One, two, three, four, five, six. I just did 60, didn't I? I don't have enough for 60, but that's all right. I only need 36, I think I figured out. We'll just go ahead and make all of this into another brick. Okay. And go ahead and throw that back into here. Boop. Okay, so next we need these magma creams. And I need nine of those. So let's go ahead and ask for ten. Do, 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 do. Okay, there we have our magma creams. And now we can ask for this. And get nine of those. Originally that's what I was getting ready the nether to do. But uh, I completely forgot that almost everything I needed I could produce. So. That's why I haven't gone to the nether lately. Let's go ahead and empty some of the junk out of our inventory here. Okay. And let's sleep to make a day. And we need a couple other things here. Let's get a supplier. We have a supplier pipe. We have one. 
And let's get some, let's see what else we have for pipe here. Cobblestone. Let's get, uh, oh, I don't have that much. Let's go ahead and get that much. And then get uh, one of these. And let's get a stack of iron. Oops. And a stack of, char stack of charcoal. Okay. Now let's figure out where we're going to put this. Do, 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 do. I think I should put it near my railcraft stuff, but I don't know if there's room in there. So we'll go ahead and find out. It'll fit right there. So let's go ahead and build this. Oops. Come back here. So we lay down three for base, and then we do two hollow levels. And then cap it off with a non-hollow level. And if we did it all right, yep, it formed its multi part. Now, question is where? There's that. And that's where that is. So let's go ahead. And we need to replace that with a basic logistics pipe. And this is going to be tricky because I've got myself sort of trapped. Oh no, I can go this way. Hopefully I can go this way if I hit the right key. So we'll get out our stone transport pipes here. So we didn't exactly run it the best place, but that was where it was convenient. So let's go ahead. Run it this way. Okay, and then we'll want to run it this way. to run it under here. Okay, I'll go ahead and put dirt back here. So we may have enough dirt. There we go. And then we're going to run over here. And right here put our supplier pipe. Oop. And get out our wrench. Set this for partial. Go ahead 
and put our iron in there. And there it goes. Sorry to fill us auto filling with our uh, charcoal. Now let's see if we have some grass here. We have a grass block. So we're going to take it and run over here. We I think this works. Run in here. Put our grass block in here. Pink. And apparently that doesn't work. It won't let me make grass block. Will make me let me make dirt ones. It'll let me make dirt ones. Just to make it look a little neater. I need to actually do a floor in here at some point. There we go. Looks a little neater. And now that will pre be producing steel for us. Our disenchanter. See if there's anything over here either. We need to disenchant. Yep. I pretty much let those run all the time. And as you can see, I have tons and tons of mob essence, so we're doing well there. Okay, let those run through the disenchanter and get us more books. Okay, what next is the question? We gotta wait for the steel, but we can go ahead and make our fireboxes and place those down. So we're gonna use solid fuel for this. So let's see what we need for solid fuel. Fireboxes, fire. So we're going to need steel plates, iron bars, buckets, and fire chargers. To make a fire charge, it just takes that, that, and that. So we should have all that. And we're going to need three of those. Okay, that gives us our fire charges. Okay. Actually, why that's doing it? Ah, I can't type. So, jetpacks. To make an armored hardened jetpack, we have a hardened jetpack now. To armor it, well, we don't need that. Okay, jetpack. So, I need Tinker's Alloy Armor Plating, which I make by putting armor and tink 10 tinkers alloy to make armor plates I do that okay so let's first of all make our armored plate iron 
iron and tin. Huh. Then we need bronze, bronze. Do, 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 do. It's the right type of tin. Sure taking a long time for the tin to get here. Oh, it's already here. I was sitting there waiting for it, and it was there all the time. Sometimes I'm majorly derping. Okay, so we go over here to our induction smelter, and put in our bronze and our iron plate. And there we have Tinker's alloy plate. Now to actually use that, we have to have that in our hand, that our inventory, after using Y sneakings. Okay, that's complicated. So let's sneak. Right click. Yay! So we're now hardened. So with we have that much armor without it. So if we take off that, we get down to that, and if we put that back on. Not great, not as good as our uh, diamond armor, but better than nothing when we're flying around. So let's go get some of the steel. Do, do, do. I may have to pause this because we're probably going to need a lot of steel. Yeah, we only have six so far, so I will be back after we have a whole bunch more steel cook up. Okay, while we're waiting to steal, there's a couple other things we'll need to make. First of all, I'm going to need two aqueous accumulators. So that means I'm going to need two of those. One, two. Do, do, do. I need two of those. One, two. And we have to wait on the gear, of course. gears. Logistic pipes is flexible, but it's not very fast, especially when I have as long a network as this. Speaking of which, I want to check on something while we're waiting for that. I don't think they've got a recipe yet for the crafting modules. Nope. I'd really like to use them, but if they don't have a recipe, you can't. Okay. Anytime, gears. Whoops, wrong one. I think I had a problem with crafting gears, but I've done several updates, so it's possible. Ah! That's not what I wanted. I wanted that. Tin, okay.
Well, that's interesting. The copper's there. The tin's there. Ah, apparently they changed the recipe back again. So let's go tin gear. See if they did the same thing to us with copper gear. Yep. I'm actually happy that it's this has been done, but okay, so bronze gear. Hopefully I have that type of bronze. No, I have that type of bronze. Bronze. And then we'll order our tin gears. Make sure that works. And we're going to need or copper gears too. Okay, let's go over here and fix this recipe. Where were it? There it is. And this, of course, isn't working because I didn't import that. So let's try this one more time. And we probably have extra stuff in here now. Yep. Okay, now let's see if it worked. I'm still not seeing tin gears. It says it was successful. The gears are there. And they're gone. Okay, now it's working. Okay, that should be fixed then. Do, 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 do. As you can see, we're producing more than enough ethanol now with the second tree farm and that. So let's go ahead and throw these in here. Make these. Throw those in there. And we should have everything. To build our aqueous accumulators. One. Oh, have to switch to the other type of copper gear. One, two. that away. Mm. 
And why that's going, let's go and see how we're doing on steel. Here's steel. That should give us a... I should have built the buildings around the mob spawners, probably a hair bigger. But then I'd have problems with them not going where they need to go. So we need to go in here. And get some steel plates made. Okay. And our aqueous accumulator should be done. One, two. And what happened to my other gear? I lost my copper gear. Oh well, we'll order another one. I'm sure it's looking me right in the face. Okay, now we're back to building And I've completely forgot what it was. Firebox, that's what we're looking for. Oh, well, apparently it was much easier than I thought. I don't know what firebox I was looking at before. Firebox. That's the solid. Well, I was looking at the fuel. We want the solid. Oh, we're missing a furnace. Apparently they don't auto make furnaces. So let's go ahead and order our furnace. Okay. And then we can put our steel plates in here. And we're going to need high pressure. Whoops. High pressure. That won't be enough to actually build it, but we'll go ahead and show you. Because we're getting towards that wrapping up point. Do, 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 do. Okay. I've already set up a pipe here and uh, water here. So what we're going to do is go ahead and put our aqueous accumulators down here and here. And then our fireboxes will go here. And then ultimately And I may take out the ceiling so that that can go higher. Because I'm going to have to move these lights for sure.
Actually, we, we won't replace those. We'll just leave those off. And we'll have next episode. We'll come back and uh, get our bo finish our boiler here. Get it up and going. And uh, then hook it up so we can get some power generation. So, as always, if you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and give me a like or a comment. And if you dislike the episode, leaving me a dislike is fine, but please leave a comment saying why you dislike the episode. As always, this is Spidey1958, and have fun Minecrafting.